my dear friends welcome to the seeker channel in this channel you'll find information about topics such as dream analysis astrology health cooking life skills and other topics of interest i can promise you that my experiences are well researched and will give you good results as it is based on tried and tested methods uh, such as Swapna Shastra and Garuda Purana along with Western Dream Interpretation, Persian Dream Interpretation and Psychoanalysis by Freud and Jung. Now if you look at lots of dream analysis themes on YouTube channels, it would simply tell you that the dream is good or bad or whether you'll get money or lose money etc. Honestly, this is not how dream interpretation works. Let me give you an example. If you see gold coins in your dream, as per some dream literature, you are supposed to get money. In some literature, you are to lose money and also you are to be careful about your financial transactions. This could be direct or indirect, which is true. However, the most important point is your mindset and the psychology which is the most important factor in understanding your dream. Hence the interpretation of dream is strictly personal and not generic. In way the dream interpretation which was 1500 or 2000 years ago, the world was an entirely different place. People had very little to think about and their lives were very simple. They had a healthy mindset, a healthy body, which had little or no illnesses. And dream interpretation of those times were direct and symbolical. Which meant, if anyone dreamt of gold in the old days, it meant that the person would acquire gold, which was the only currency at that time, by doing a good trade or having a bumper harvest. Or the dream was just the lack of it in other words, which means the person was just being desirous in his waking life. The same cannot be applied in today's world when all of us have hundreds of thoughts and ideas in our head, as our world is currently very hectic. So if you analyze dreams from a psychological or psychoanalytical viewpoint of Freud, all dreams reveal the person's deepest unconscious wishes and desires. The dream symbol were an attribute of one's relationship with people around himself or herself, mostly hinting at sexual desires or the lack of it. These may not be the true meaning of your dreams. So how is my research any different? Well, it has taken me 20 years in this journey of deciphering what the dreams could mean. The mind, my friends, is like a bottomless pit and understanding it could consume all our lives. We are here to try understanding life by simply living it with all the good and the bad. Maybe that is the meaning of life. Without going into the analysis of sleep and sleep patterns, there are basically three types of dreams. The first dream would be a replay of the past incidents as a dream. The second would be aspects of the current life, that is, your day-to-day -day anxiety or dreams based on our current happiness levels. The third type of dream is the dreams of the future, which is precognitive or prophetic dreams. So before we understand more on dream interpretation, there are some basic rules that you should know. So first ask yourself, is the dream during day or night? Only dreams during the night sleep is to be considered for interpretation. This is because the night sleep is the most restful sleep, so we consider only that. And the time of the dream does not really matter. The second question to ask is, can I consider everything I see in my dreams? Yes, you can. All of the dream objects that you remember can be considered for interpretation. The third question to ask is, did I dream whatever I dreamt after I was drunk or after taking sleep or anxiety or any opioid medication. 
then does my dream count? No. The fourth question to ask is, am I seeing too many objects in my dream and am, am I not being able to understand what the dream means? Well, please don't waste your time analyzing those dreams. If you don't understand it, just forget it. Lastly, we'll have to understand how we perceive ourselves in the dream. So are we experiencing dream or are we seeing another version of ourselves in the dream? In other words, are you watching yourself as a third person, like uh, watching yourself on a movie screen? Or are you the watcher? Which means are you the character in the movie that is acting? If you're watching yourself, in the dream then it symbolizes how others perceive you or if you are the dream watcher it means self-expression now second thing to perceive or understand from your dream is are you dreaming in black and white or in color for most people dreams are in black and white and for some the dreams are in color some people occasionally have colorful objects in a black and white background so you have to remember the dream as best as you can well that's it for today ladies and gentlemen the introduction is over very soon i will upload videos and start giving you interpretation of dream objects that are most common one by one for now thank you for watching this video i once again request you to subscribe to this channel and motivate me in this journey Catch you soon. Good luck and God bless. Namaste.